Doc was very much kind of, you might consider him as an ambassador of Appalachia as he traveled the world and uh, reflected Appalachian values and Appalachian, uh, you know, music and culture. And he did it so incredibly well and, and with a sense of humor. He was a great entertainer. I mentioned, of course, he was, you know, a master guitar player, considered among the greatest acoustic guitar players of all time. Um, and he made many recordings so that uh, his, his legacy of, of recordings uh, speaks for itself in terms of his mastery on the acoustic guitar. Anyone who heard him live can uh, testify to the thrilling nature of his guitar technique. Um, he would take risks while playing particular tunes that no one else would do. And, you, you know, he, he was a very successful improviser on traditional melodies. And um, he would play contemporary songs beautifully. Doc was also a, a wonderful singer, um, had a beautiful um, kind of baritone voice that, uh, you know, was very authentic and clearly articulated lyrics. Um, um, he had a rich, warm kind of tone and timbre. Um, it, was, it was a unique uh, combination of uh, amazingly precise guitar playing and, and rich and vibrant vocals. Um, Doc was really a versatile musician, of course. He could also play the banjo, he could play the harmonica, and frequently played these different instruments on his recordings.